Frugal's and videos are powered by Jetline Systems. Hello YouTube, this is Frugal and this is the Frugal Sim News for today, Friday the 13th of August. First up, DC Design's F-14 AMB Tomcat for Microsoft Flight Sims. DC Design's latest aircraft, the F-14 Tomcat, is due to release from Just Flight on the 19th, that's next week. As always with DC Design's, the Tomcat has been coded to fully comply with the MSFS native behaviors, which should, in theory, isolate it from problems as the sim gets updated. It features a stunning visual model in and out of the cockpit and makes full use of Microsoft Flight Sim's new effects and sounds, including reflective glass, aerodynamic sound structures, as well as custom effects for those used within the afterburners. Both the front and rear cockpits in the aircraft are modelled, as well as accurate 3D dials, the ADI, the Whiskey Compass, and many more. The display screens and the HUD in the Tomcat are also built to closely match the real deal, but it's worth noting that this is not a study level aircraft at a level of DCS Tomcat. If you feel the need, the need for speed, head on over to Just Flight later this week and pick up the DC Designs F-14 for Microsoft Flight Sim for just £24.99. Next up, MK Studios Fuerteventura Airport. MK Studios' latest for MSFS covers Huertaventura Airport, an airport that only averages 16 days of rain per year and is a key tourist destination, handling almost 7 million passengers per year. MK Studios' version covers, of course, the airport itself, complete with accurate runway elevation, a new land mesh, and an up-to-date ground layout. That's all I have, really, on this. There's not a whole lot of detail beyond that, but NK Studios Fuerteventura is available right now from Orbex Direct and will cost you about $15. Next up, Flymex Mexico City International, again for Microsoft Flight Sim. Now, I covered Flymex quite some time ago and their goal of bringing key locations of Mexico into Microsoft Flight Sim. Their latest release covers Mexico City International. Now, also known as Benito Juarez International, the airport is one of the busiest in Latin America, handling more than 30 airlines, 17 cargo carriers, and four government agencies. As always, PBR materials are used everywhere, and alongside the highly detailed buildings and airport layout, the package also includes the new Terminal 2 extension, new parking positions at Terminal 1, elevation at the airport is also fixed, the default one in Microsoft Flight Sim is a little bit off, and the package also includes accurate VOR and ILS positioning and alignment. Flymex Mexico City is available right now for MSFS from Sim Market for 19 euros and 79 cents. Next up, prepared news and the release of Aerosoft's Leopaya Airport for Prepared. Aerosoft's latest airport for Prepared covers Leopaya in Latvia. In the real world, this is an airport that went through a rebuild in 2014, adding in new lighting, runways, and taxiways. Aerosoft's version, of course, captures those changes. Aerosoft's version was built from aerial photography and includes not only the airport, but also the nearby city of Leopaya. The scenery includes animated wind socks that respond correctly to the current weather conditions. Runway lighting is also linked to the current weather conditions, which is kind of cool. Within the nearby city, there are tons of unique buildings and features, including custom berths in the seaport, as well as models of the university, the sports complex, the cathedral, and more. PBR materials are used everywhere, of course, and seasonal textures and trees, seasonal trees, are also included. Aerosoft's Leopaya is available right now from Sim Market for prepared five and will set you back 23 euros and 15 cents. Explain news now and the Magni M16 and M22 gyrocopters. The Magni M16 and M22 gyrocopters model the Magni Gyro, which is an Italian gyrocopter, of course, with the next plane. Now, there's two models included. The M16 is a tandem trainer with dual seats and dual controls. The M22 is based on the M16, but has more storage and fuel. The aircraft features custom Rotax Flydat, Trig TY91 radio and Trig TT21 transponders, accurate Rotax engine modeling, interactive pre-flight checks and PBR textures. It also strangely includes two bonus scenery packages, Chattel Air Airfield close to Aosta and Cortina d'Ampezzo Airport in Spain, which play host or will play host to the 2026 Olympics. The Magni M16 and M22 gyrocopters are available for X-Plane right now from the X-Plane.org store for $21. Finally this week, Digital Designs Salzburg version 2 for X-Plane. 
Digital Design have released version 2 of their Salzburg Airport for X-Plane. It covers, of course, the second largest airport in Austria with a single 2700 meter runway and two passenger terminals. The new version updates the layout of the package to match the current airport layout and also adds in new textures, new 3D models, new buildings, and now includes new landmarks in the nearby city of Salzburg. The package uses PBR materials everywhere, new ground markings, the interior of Terminal 2, albeit simplified, and updated models everywhere, it even got 3D grass. Owners of the original airport can upgrade to the new one for €7.50. Alternatively, new customers can pick up Digital Designs at Salzburg for X-Plane from Sim Market for €17.50. That's it for this week's new show. As always, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this. My name is Frugal, and I will see you all very soon.